AI music channels are going viral on TikTok and YouTube, and they're making thousands of dollars. But they are not even showing music videos, which would allow them to grow 10 times as large as they currently are. I was wondering about this, and I found this one AI tool that creates music videos like this. I'll just run out, make dope tracks, and in time you'll find that I'm always on your side through life's ride. So when you want to like that. And like this. I don't even like her. Just the idea of her. This isn't love, just a mental clutter. Yeah, she's a and it creates these videos in minutes. And honestly, I wasn't expecting them to look this professional. But here's the thing. There is a catch that most people don't tell you about AI video generation. And by the end of this video, you'll know exactly how to avoid it. Look, I've created hundreds of AI songs at this point and my Suno AI tutorial got over 400,000 views. So thank you guys so much for subscribing and watching those videos. As a result, I've tested pretty much every AI video tool out there in order to create music videos for those songs. But here is what nobody talks about. Most AI video generators either look obviously fake, <laughs> remember this guy? Or you might as well hire someone to make music videos for you. And that's frustrating because the music side has been figured out. AI can create incredible songs now, but the visual side, that's been the weak link. So when Open Art reached out to me and said that they would give me early access to something different, I was skeptical at first. Full transparency here, they gave me early access to try this tool, but all of my opinions are my own. As I'm trying them out, they're still in beta, and I asked them to give me an early access code for my viewers, and you can check that out in the description. Now, here's what caught my attention. Instead of just generating random visuals, this thing actually analyzes your music and creates story-driven content. So this means character consistency, lip sync that doesn't look weird, and visual styles that actually match your vibe of the song. But the real question here is, can it actually deliver real-looking results without having to tweak it for hours? Let's find out by creating three music videos for three different songs. Let's go. <laughs> Let's get locked in. Click on the link in the description in order to get access to this open art beta. Open art lets you create videos, images, and characters at ease, and they just created a new feature called stories, where you can create character vlogs, explainer videos, or what we'll test out in this video, they let you create music videos. Click on that or on this thing right here, and you're led to this page. It's very simple to use. Simply upload your song, select either the style, the story, or the sing method, and it will create the music video for you. So I'm gonna go over to Suno and take one of the songs that I created with Suno AI. Let's take this uh, country hip hop fusion song and let's click on download. And we will test it with two other songs. Now that we're back here, simply select the song and drag it out. Quick note here, with the beta, the limitation is one minute, but I expect them to extend that as they do the public launch. Click on confirm. And now select uh, one of the three modes. Either you can select style, where you can choose your style or create your own style. For example, they have city pop or they have animated uh, styles. The second mode is the story mode, where you can either have an auto story mode where it creates a story or you click on a one star story. Or lastly, they are currently testing the beta of the sing method, where you can choose one of the characters or upload a character and have the character lip sync. For this video, we will click on the story method. Let's click on the one star story and let's choose one of the characters characters that fits our singer's vibe. Let's view all, and in this case, Jaden fits the vibe of the song the best. Let's click on that. The story topics section is optional. You can give it creative direction by saying exactly what you want the story to be about. But in this case, let's leave it blank and see if it is able to auto detect what the song is about and the style that we're going for. The aspect ratio that we're going for is gonna be 16 by nine in order for us to post it on YouTube. And in the advanced settings, you can select an image model, any of these, as well as the video model. They have the best video models out there, as you can see here. 2.1 standard and Kling uh, 2.1 Pro are really good. Uh, Minimax Hilu uh, O2 is really good. And the other options are also uh, really good. And they're adding more and more options as better models become available. You can see here that this song uh, consumes about a thousand credits, which is anywhere between a dollar and two dollars per video. Let's click on create story. It's now creating the story script, creating the images, and then creating the videos. Once it's done, you, we can preview and edit the video after the fact in order to make small tweaks. While it's generating this, let's create two more music videos to showcase how easy it is. In order to do that, I'm simply creating a new tab, going back to music video, and this time I will upload uh, a second song. So this song here is with a female voice. Oh my love. Let's use that, extend this to the full duration, confirm. And now let's test out the sync capability where it is lip syncing as the artist is singing. Let's click on that and let's use one of their characters. Uh, let's go with a female, either Yuki, Jess, let's go with Ali. 
The advanced settings in this case, let's leave it on flux character. And this time it's important to keep it with Hydra because now the lip sync uh, needs to be activated. And let's click on create story. Once again, it's creating the story script, it's creating the images and then the videos. We'll circle back in just a minute once it's done. Let's do this one more time, but I will show you a different style of music video that this is able to create. For this song, we will go with a song I call The Idea of Her. So this song is a bit more abstract, so for that, let's create a more abstract music video. Let's confirm right here. And I'm clicking on the select a mode. And in this case, let's go with one of the presets that they made. Let's go with the EDM and see what it comes up with. I'm simply clicking on create story. Once again, it's creating the story script, creating the image and creating the video. A few moments later. Let's check out these music videos. It only took about a minute to create this music video. Uh, so let's check it out. So I was able to notice that there is a guitar in the beginning and it added the guitar into the, the video, which is great. With the flick of my wrist, I try to do something nice, but that's life. Appreciation for wasting my time, it's okay. I'm fine, I'll just rhyme, make dope tracks, and in time, you'll find that I'm always on your side through life's ride. So when you want to be unkind, take that shit elsewhere, because the attitude is not welcome here. Every day should be at least decent. I mean it, that behavior that is awesome. It created this whole like country style bar theme and created a story about it with different characters, different scenes. And uh, keep in mind, I didn't ask it to lip sync in this particular video. So we will check that out in just a minute. However, if you notice something here, this looks weird. He's holding the guitar backwards. Out of pocket for that. So if something like this happens and you're not happy with this, you can always click on edit this story. Within this, we'll go to the frame that we didn't like and we can either regenerate the image. You can see here, this is the still image that it used to generate the video. So we can retry the image and this time it doesn't look as weird. And then we would also go to the video section and click on retry video. And here is the second version. Great, it doesn't have these artifacts, so let's use that instead. And if you also want to change the duration of any of these clips, just simply uh, go down here to the editor and uh, you can extend or shorten each of the videos. We'll keep it at the standard duration that it chose for us. If you want to share this video, simply click on the share button and I'm just going to download it to my computer. And I will leave all of the full videos towards the end of my video so that you can check them out next to each other. But first, let's check out the lip sync feature. If we go over to our second generation, here is the video that we made. It's been a while without thinking of you, but the dawn makes me smile. All right, the lip sync is really good so far. Here, I'm noting that the drones are not flying. There's no background sound, so that's a little bit weird. Smile, I'm so tired of wanting. Once again, I think this is really impressive how the lip sync works so well. It was able to time the beat so that there's transitions happening every three to five seconds. And overall, the quality of the video is also really good. I'm leaving the full music video towards the end of my video because I also wanted to show you the last creation that we made. Here's the last abstract type of music video that we just created within a few minutes. And let's check it out. I don't even like her. This is great. Maybe I chose the wrong style, but this is kind of giving me EDM festival vibes that you see on the screens behind the artist. But if that was the case, this is really cool because it's it's kind of trippy, it's creative, and it's very visually appealing. One more note, I just noticed right away that the second scene comes in a little bit too soon because the singer is not singing yet. Check this out. So if we wanted to change that, once again, let me click on the edit the story and let's extend this. Over here, we see that the video's default speed is at 1.5. Let's bring this down to one. 
extending this a little bit. I'm moving the shot of the microphone up front where he just says the few words and I'm shortening it until he starts singing fully. And that's when I'm bringing in this part of the video. Let's see if this works better. I don't even like her. Just the idea of her. This isn't All right, that's great. Now, when the drop hits, we need to change the scene again. This isn't love, just a mental clutter. And then we'll change the drop again on the beats just because everything got shifted a little bit. I don't even like her. Just the idea of her. This isn't love, just a mental clutter. Yeah, she's a muse, but I wouldn't touch her. How cool is that? I don't think it has ever been simpler to make uh, really creative music videos in just a few minutes. All right, here's my honest take. This is the first AI music video tool that makes AI music videos effortless. Some of the shots and frames still look a bit much like AI, but with the editing features, you can get rid of that and uh, tailor the music video to be exactly how you want it to be. And the character consistency is actually really good. And the lip sync feature is also awesome. So for anyone creating AI music videos, this is the tool that I would use. Quick note about the cost of all of this. Each generation costs 1000 credits and with $14, you get 12,000 credits. So it comes out to about a dollar per music video. Click the link in the description and I think I'll get my viewers a discount for the ones that choose to go with the paid version. Which of the three styles that I tried out worked the best in your opinion? Drop in the comments if you like the country song, the lip sync, or the abstract music video. Also, if you wanted to see the full music videos, don't click away because I will show them after my outro. And if you're building any kind of AI business systems, consider subscribing to my channel because I'm currently working on a few videos that are really exciting and you might want to check them out. I have this whole guide on how to make money with AI generated music that have some of these ideas, for example, YouTube content creation, and the whole playbook of creating AI music videos perfectly fits into that category. But as you can see here, there's other strategies that I'm outlining as well. All right, here are the three videos and let me know in the comments which of the three is your favorite. If you've subscribed, I'll see you in the next video. With the flick of my wrist, I try to do something nice, but that's life. Appreciation for wasting my time, it's okay, I'm fine. I'll just rhyme, make dope tracks in time. You'll find that I'm always on your side through life's ride. So when you wanna be unkind, take that shit elsewhere, cause the attitude is not welcome here. Every day should be at least decent. I mean it, that behavior you need to clean it. Dream big, smoke a cig, whatever it is that makes you not feel like shit. Smile for this dude Remember the fun we had is so cool Let's go to other parts of the world so we can roll through I told you I better forever cause you're here My friend you know It's been a while without Here. 
Mind. 